All right, guys, let's keep going with our Hunter playthrough of the zombie island of Dr. Ned for Borderlands. So we have uh, two missions that we need to do in this zone, and I'm pretty full on ammo. So let's just uh, get right down to it. What is that? Alright, let me just uh, double check where we have to go here. Okay, so for this one we have to go there. Okay, so both of them are pretty close to each other, so... Let's just start heading up there. We'll take this little shortcut. Oh my god, are these like... These zombies have like glasses? Yeah, I kind of... Yeah, I kind of mentioned it previously, but uh, I I don't think I have actually ever played this uh, DLC before. Because I don't remember any of this stuff, but it has been a really long time since I, I played any of Borderlands. The uh, Borderlands game I played the most by far was Borderlands 2. I played that a uh, lot co-op. Let's just hit that. Get out of here. Get that guy. Alright, where do we got to go here? Throw my blood wing out. I haven't used it in quite a while. Oh man, I'm dead. I'm gonna have to swap out to a different gun, otherwise I'm just gonna run out of ammo. This usually gets the job done. Dead. Another trophy from my wall. All right, I am really low on combat rifle ammo.
Okay, so I did that one. Um, let's see. It's alive. Okay, so I think I have to actually go inside this lab here. place. Choose Dr. Ned before you're undead. Zombies trying to tear your face off by shield and then by an insta helm. For when the shield inevitably goes down and you really need it. I'm just going to stick with the uh, shields I have right now. Uh, okay, this is going to be hard to say. So, one of my reanimated corpses sort of ate Bell today. And by sort of, I mean, he is now crapping his bones in the yard. The good news is he's already paid me rent. And I don't have to listen to him bitch about toenail clippings that totally weren't even mine. Not to mention the popcorn shenanigans. Consider this my solemn promise to begin attempting evil for the sake of profit from this point on. My brother, who isn't even the same as me in disguise, would never support me in this. I hope no one ever finds these logs and incriminates me to my employer, Jacobs, because that would probably set off a whole chain of events where I have to try and kill them with my horrific creations. This is the first official entry of my, Dr. Ned's, scientific discovery journal. My ongoing mission to extend the lives of those who have already passed. We must remain vigilant in our... Bill! Bill! Are you making popcorn? What did we talk about? Dude, we just talked about this. Uh, where was I? Um, saving the human race from the stale clenches of death. Oh, that sounds like a kicking party. Is that how the kids are saying it, kicking? Anyway, here ends my first official journal entry. I found that despite his infernal popcorn habit, I kind of miss Bill. Frank, the temp that replaced him, just wasn't the same, and definitely had too small a hunchback to suit my taste and assistance. Yeah, he was no Bill. Yeah, he was no Bill. Man. I really wish Bill hadn't gotten all masticated by that zombie. Actually, I got an idea. I still have some body parts around here from Frank. Maybe there's something I can do. Greetings, loyal Nedcast viewership. Now in the third week of my clinical trials with corpse reanimation. The scan cells have reacted well to the treatment, but the bodies themselves seem to have uncontrollable hunger. Right now, it seems all they crave is raisins and bran muffins. But I fear with strength applied to the cell reanimation, their hunger will grow much stronger and possibly dangerous. Fear not, I will trudge forward unhindered by the possible destruction of mankind. Am I mad? Probably. But at least I don't make popcorn when people are trying to work. All right. Hope you guys heard that. Let's see. Uh, it's a live info found. Yeah, I decided to just let those calm things, uh, echo recorders, play. Just because they tell some of the storyline. Alright, how do we get out of here? Okay, I think I have to actually leave this lab completely.
this uh, mission kind of reminds me of Old Haven in the main game. Okay, that that is kind of odd. I'm not quite sure how to get around there. I guess I turn right here. Alright guys, let's see if I can find a way over to that, that area over there. Oh, nice. I think this is it. There we go. second wind and get the hell out of here.
nice. Where's he at? Oh wow, I think I killed him. Let's try something else.
Oh, this is working a lot better. Sometimes you just have to cheese your way through boss fights. how you get it done guys I guess so grab some ammo a pistol or a revolver I should say check out our quest log here okay so we have to turn that one in at Jacob's cave so let's go do this one since it's in the same area here yeah there's just so many enemies coming back there it was insane Okay, we have to actually turn this one in here, so... Oh, I guess we just do it right here. Nice. God, so they're gonna send a crap load of zombies my way, I bet.
Okay, survive. This is a nice spot. Maybe? No? in there. Oh man. That was pretty brutal.
All right, let's go turn these in. Those were a couple of pretty tough quests. guys well i'm gonna go ahead and end that video here that one ran a bit long just because of those uh couple deaths i had at the franken zombie but when we come back we're gonna go do a few more few more missions so thanks for watching make sure you subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for some more of the zombie island of dr ned thanks guys